we have team 18, Atharv Revtikar, Azizur Rahman, Abhigya Pranshu. A uh, uh, very good evening to the jury panel, uh, to my colleagues and to my mentors sitting over here. Our project is generally based on a project on energy saving by using microcontroller and embedded system. I am the ideator Athar Brevdikar, developer Ajizur Rahman and the designer is Abhigya Pranshu. Please change the next slide. The how the necessity of project was. Basically the project was needed in order to save the electrical energy that we are suffering crisis for and the household appliances that were being switched on and to facilitate more human. Next slide please. And by thinking about the necessities, the idea came to overcome the problem of waste of electrical energy. We thought a program based on automation and control devices by using embedded systems. In these systems, we use the microcontroller and embedded system. The development board is made of microcontroller resistors, capacitors, and the buzzers and LEDs. So, next slide. This is what the basic idea, the block diagram is showing, is showing. Microcontroller is for feeding the data and to burn the program in it and the relay and the glowing bulb inside it. So what we can use is uh, the usage of this uh, project was basically in household appliances that whenever we go out for some uh, some reasons without closing the light and bulbs or whenever we go inside we have to switch on the light bulbs. So the basic idea was that whenever we go inside the bulb closes automatically and whenever we go outside the bulb or the fence goes down automatically. So this uh, at this short period of time we could only manage up to uh, this demo prototype. So what basically it will be doing is it will be counting the persons going inside and the room is initially an empty room. So uh, my friends will show you the demonstration of it. So as soon as the person goes in the light will turn on. This is a person of thermocol. The person one goes in. Light started glowing. The person two goes in. Uh, sorry, uh, for the. Please make it fast. The person one goes in and the light turns on. Person 2 goes in, lights are still on. Person 3 goes in, lights are still on. Now the person coming outside. 1 goes out, it is on. 2 goes out, it is on. 3 goes out, it's off. So the basic idea was, if the room is empty, light will automatically shut down. Uh, I mean to say that uh, we can make uh, such a machine that if uh, the temperature outside is less then the fan could turn off accordingly. 
we can set uh, the temperature by programming process. So uh, the basic criteria of this uh, machine is that it should be small. It should uh, it should cost around uh, 800 rupees to 1200 rupees based on your requirement it has a buzzer too that would um, uh, that would make you that the light is open it can but if you don't need so if you know it totally automatic it will cost up to 100 to 12, 1200 rupees so this is a project that could be uh, easily used for household appliances uh, basically uh, we what we did is if oh, okay ma'am if we waste a 10 unit, uh, 10 unit in a month, then it would cost around 100 rupees in a month. So in eight months, we can overcome the money of the project. So this is what we did. And the, uh, can we have the next slide? So the working was uh, we used the two directional PIR sensors placed on the door, as you can see. When a person comes in, it senses uh, it senses that the person coming in uh, first of the sensors and then second sensors, and then the PIR sensors coming the incoming and outgoing motion of uh, a person. Then they send a signal to the microcontroller, and the number of people are registered in the room. The microcontroller switches uh, on the light, and the uh, it uh, it turns according to the persons. So as soon as the person count becomes to zero, it switch off the light. So it's basically on the count of people. Uh, it's a short of period of time. We could totally manage this one, but we could make according to the human senses. So if a person sleeps, so the television automatically goes off. So, so this kind of stuff also we can do, but uh, we could only manage this prototype. But we have the greater vision for it, looking ahead for some more inventions that we couldn't make in it. Thank you, sir. Hi, uh, thank you, team, for the presentation. Uh, I want to ask you, what is the cost of manufacturing or producing one of these products? Sir, uh, for one house, uh, uh, for up to 8 to 10 electronic devices, uh, one of this microcontroller is enough, and that will cost about 800 to 1200. So my question is, how much does it take you to manufacture this? Yes. Sir, 800 to 1200, there is nothing in this. We have to use one more relay for switch and relays are very cheap. So and it, it uses uh, 6 volt DC. That's okay. What I'm asking you is, if it costs you 1200 bucks, yes. if you're selling at 1200 bucks, yes. what's your profit? No, we will not sell that. We will uh, try to make it uh, better uh, and if we can get offer by some company we can sell this prototype or whatever uh, sir means uh, basically uh, if we are making uh, actually the cost was around 830 uh, including the batteries mm -hmm. so if we are selling this at 900 also mm -hmm. and a person can uh, overcome this 900 in 9 months that's okay so you as a as an entrepreneur, yes. you must think of what is your income, right? If you're producing this for 1200 and if you're selling it for 1200, there is no point of doing that. Right. Sir, that's what. Sir, we won't sell in 1200. The cost of making this one is 830, so we'll uh, sell in 900, obviously. So, sir, 70% each. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Actually, this kind of uh, smartphone kind of design or product is uh, very good, very widely in mind. For example, the picture of Nest. That is one of the top players in the market. Right? But why I, according to me, why I feel interested in this is that it's cost the same. Right? I mean, in terms of product, Nest is in terms of cost of product. It's one of the most Sir, the only thing that uh, we have to change the sensors in it. So, sir, if we change the sensors, we could make it better. If, uh, for example, if we make a human sensor in it, so it could sense the human uh, or the temperature sensors. So, according to human, if there are five humans, the fan will turn, uh, means it will uh, rotate by more RPM. 
so if the temperature is outside low and means you are feeling a uh, colder it will automatically turn low so so we can make it uh, for greater uh, idea we have that idea that uh, we can make a uh, human sensors or temperature sensors we can customize it with that but for such short period of time we could only make infrared sensors like, active infrared sensors to use in it. Okay, so, I mean, it's a study question, right? But, so you have pets in the house, right? All the humans are out. You have dogs and... Well, you can can see now. Will your sensors still work? No, uh, sir, frequency, uh, we'll define a frequency, sir. For frequency, there will be a difference by a human. Okay, makes sense. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Yes. Sorry, sir. So at this point, is it the object count or is it the person count? Sir, it is a person count. Oh, sir, in this, sir, in this project, sir, in this project, it will count both of the things. So, so because it is general and active infrared sensor, it won't uh, differentiate between object and uh, only for this prototype. But I said earlier, for greater vision, we have a human sensor or a means, uh, no, temperature sensor is a different thing. So uh, we have a human sensor that would detect a general frequency of human only, okay, which will uh, turn automatic light only for the humans, not for pets, not for objects. Okay. Now, if you have to plug this into a house, yes, sir. assume you want to plug this there, out there. Yes. So what is the intervention that is required to kind of make this work? Have you thought through that? Yes, sir, sir, I will. So let me let me repeat. If, I'm yes, sir. if you have to use this device into your house, what do you need to do? What changes do you need to do? Okay, sir. Sir, in case, uh, in place of these uh, hardware switches, we would like to place transistor switches, or we can place relays. And uh, only thing we have to do is uh, put our sensors uh, to the doors, and beside it, we can um, install that microcontroller embedded board. That's thing. That's only thing. Okay. So. Next question and last question. Yes. In your roadmap, do you have any plan to integrate with a mobile device to provide alerts? Yes, sir. We can customize it. It is based on only computer programming. If we change the program and we can use GPS system, it will send messages. Thank you. Sir, we can use. Last. DTMF also in this. Yeah, last uh, thing, last question. Uh, certain things are very used. Say, for example, you've been talking about the speed of the fan, the, uh, the temperature of the geyser, and things like that. Yes. Certain things are very used. My choice, Steve's choice, the child's choice, these are different. What about the very beauty? What about, what about certain things with an exception? Suppose, in case I want to leave my room, yes. but I want, to, I want my fans to be there on for another 10 15 minutes. Maybe my visa I want to be on for another 10 minutes. What about exceptions? Sir, uh, if you want to waste energy, then why you are buying this device? No, I'm not talking about wasting energy. For example, Sir. I have a small class. For example, I have a small class. I have two water in the remote class, but I have to read now. I'm talking about exceptions. Sir, uh, about that, uh, we can. Uh, one program can be made that uh, if level of water goes uh, above this or below this, I according can, to this. Yeah, I can fully understand. The only concern that I'm having is everything can be changed on the program. Yes. If I'm not customized, if I am using this particular thing in my house, yes. if I customize this thing, how yes. do you integrate? Can you, can you, can you do some kind of application for me where right in the variables can be changed from my phone, from my laptop, and it is integrated in your device? That yes, yes, sir. We are thinking about that. We can design an app for this, but uh, in beginning, uh, we only have to do the programming. Okay, good. After that, we will think. Thank you, sir.